from a play design standpoint, there's few guys doing it better than Matt LaFleur is doing it in Green Bay right now. I love the creativity and how he's playing around with motion and the run concept he's using. For example, they're going to start off in pistol here. They're going to shift Josh Jacobs to offset to the left. And then they're going to motion receiver Jaden Reed over to the right. And before the snap, he's going to pirouette around back to the left and get the handoff. And watch what happens to the linebackers here. This is a good example of how motion messes with them. They're always shifting around before the snap and they can't go downhill. And all of a sudden, you have a two-back run. You have Josh Jacobs leading for Reed. You have a convoy in front of him. And watch what happens to Killa Witherspoon. He just signed with this team and then he has a deal with the left tackle in the perimeter. And he gets pancaked. But it's one thing to design a cool, funky play. It's another to be able to build on it and marry the run and pass, and that's what he does here. Later in the game, they're going to run the same motion, but to the right this time with the Reed faking the run towards the right. And, and watch what happens to the linebackers. Again, they're going to shift in the direction Reed originally went, and then they bite up on the play action that leaves Kraft wide open on this crosser. I don't know what the corner on that side is doing, but he jumps inside. I think Wicks gives him that little push, which is pretty clever, and gets downfield and blocks for Kraft, and that play ends in a touchdown. 